For this video, we will talk about auxiliary boiler. We will discuss its composition and its parts accessories. Boiler that mirror a made boiler, a vertical composite boiler. What do I mean about the words composite boiler? Composite boiler is a boiler that is an oil-fired boiler which source of heat is from a burner and from an exhaust gas from main engine through an economizer. Vertical composite boiler, since the tubes are arranged vertically. Water tube boiler because the water is inside the tubes and the product of combustion is outside the tube. Now let's go to the major parts of our boiler. Main burner. The boiler burner provides the heat necessary for converting water in the boiler into steam and is attached to the boiler. Pilot and main the pilot burner is allotted with a limited period of ignition during which it acts as a source of heat for main burner. And once the time is over, the pilot flame goes off. A pilot burner consists of a detachable nozzle with five holes to atomize the diesel fuel for instant ignition. Ignition transformer is important device for creating sparks from ignition rod by changing 100 volts voltage on primary side to high voltage 10 kV. Primary voltage of transformer has dual voltages, 100 volts and 200 volts. Be careful that wiring is different depending on primary voltage. Electric heater. Electric heater as shown in figure is used as standard to heat heavy oil of fuel to proper temperature. Heater is installed on outlet side of oil pump and oil temperature is regulated by temperature controller. Element in fuel oil heater is formed that nichrome wire is in the boiler water system. One of the important system of the boiler. Feed water pump sucked water from cascade tank then deliver to the boiler within preset level which is normal water level automatically by some detection rod. This is in start and stop feed water system not like the other feed water system, which pump runs continuously all the time. When the normal water level is reached the three, wave valve pneumatic operated will change over to circulation until the level of the boiler water will reach the preset opening to water drum again. Now let's go back to our system which is in start and stop feed water system from cascade tank suction by feed water pump to boiler water drum at a certain level then stop when the water becomes steam by the help of heating mediums like main burner and exhaust gas economizer from main engine to boiler also attached with a safety valve this valve will open automatically when the steam reach certain high pressure about 0.7 megapascal or more to save the equipment from overpressure Boiler water level gauge is a device used to know the actual water level of the boiler water. When the produced steam is already stable, we can now use the steam for heating tanks, jacket water preheat, and other usage of steam. Excess steam dump valve. Easy to understand catchulet lang ang pag tape on sayoang ex girlfriend mo. Dumping valve used to dump excess steam to atmospheric condenser. To condense to become condensate water again going back to the cascade tank and the system repeat itself. Drain cooler is used to condense excess steam and return steam to become condensate water again and then drain to cascade tank to be suctioned by feed pump and the system repeat itself. Force draft fan. The primary function of force draft fans is to supply air for combustion in steam boilers. FD fans create air pressure mechanically in the combustion chamber of a boiler. One of the most preferred ways of accumulating more energy through combustion with solid fuels is through fluidized bed combustion. Thanks for watching our next video. We will try to show you how we take maintenance of this kind of boiler burner and some tips about this burner especially the atomizer. Once again thank you.